Hi everyone, it's Miss Mackenzie here. Let's begin today's phonics. I've got some of the sounds that we have been practicing. Let's say them together. D. I can spot a digraph. Can you remember what that means, everybody? It means two letters making one sound. Well done. Qu. Z. Z. That's the quiet, unvoiced sound. It also makes the louder voiced sound mm. Shh. Ch. Well done everybody. Now today I've got my noisy box. Shall we open it up and see what's inside? Let's listen carefully. Ng. 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 Oh, did you hear that everyone? Let's have a look at our brand new sound today. Ng. What do you notice everybody? That's right, it's another digraph. We can see one two. Two letters making one sound. The first letter is N. The second letter is G. And when we see these two letters together, it can make the sound ng. Are you ready to watch a video? Let's learn the song for the digraph ng. Can you all show me your strong muscles? Ng. That's going to be our action for the ng digraph. Let's all listen to the song. If you're strong and you know it, say ng. If you're strong and you know it, say ng. If you're strong and you know it and you really want to show it, if you're strong and you know it, say ng. Well done, everybody. Let's have a go now at writing the digraph ng. So it begins with the n sound. Let's use our magic pens first and write it in the air. Down Nobby, up and over his net. Now we need to write g. Start at the top everybody and we go around the girl's face, up, down, give the girl a curl. Let's have a go at writing it. Down Nobby, up and over his net. G. Around the girl's face. It's just like a curly k, isn't it? Up, down, give the girl a curl. Let's practice again. Down Nobby, over his net around the girl's face, up, down, give the girl a curl. Let's see if you can have a go by yourself this time. Mm. Well 
well done everyone great job now i have got scruffy scruffy's going to say hello to everyone can you all give him a big wave good morning right scruffy today scruffy we are learning the digraph mm. okay scruffy is going to segment a word I wonder if you could blend the sounds together and say Scruffy's word. Are you ready, Scruffy? K, I, ng, king. Let's listen again. K, I, ng, king. That's right. Just like Mrs. King. A king wears a crown. Can you see the crown there? So we know Mrs King, that's a name. And we also have a king who is married to the queen. Okay, Scruffy's going to give us a word now that we need to segment. All right, Scruffy's word is bang. Wow. Bang! I heard a loud bang outside. I think there was a car crash. Let's all say the word. Bang! Okay, get your robot arms ready. Let's sound it out now. B, A, ng. Bang! Good job. Let's have a go at reading one of Scruffy's alien words. Ready, everyone? T, a, ng. T, a, ng. What does it say? T, a, ng. Teng? That's a silly made up word, isn't it? I bet you've never heard the teachers say, go and tidy up the teng, please. Would you like to share the tang? No, we're having tang for lunch. <laughs> it's a very silly word, isn't it, Scruffy? Shall we feed it to Scruffy, everyone? <gasps> nom, 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 nom. Well done, Scruffy. Today, we're going to learn a brand new tricky word. I'm going to point to it here on our sound mat. you see it everybody? I've written it a little bit larger here on my board. Here it is. It's a tricky word. I've put some stars around it. It's a really tricky word that we just have to remember. Our tricky word begins with the y sound. You. Can you say the tricky word with me? You. It's a tricky word because we cannot sound it out. If we sounded it out like this, y, o, uh, o, uh, y, o, uh, o, uh. <laughs> that's not right. The o uh and the o uh are making the sound oo, y, oo. So I'm going to put some stars around the tricky part here. This is the tricky part, y, oo. You, you are doing a great job today learning phonics. Well done. Today's tricky word is you. Let's have a go at writing some words with today's digraph. Ng. Now I have got two rectangles. The white rectangle is short. The red rectangle is Long. Let's all say the word long. Long. Shall we sound it out, everybody? L, O, ng. Long. Let's count the sounds in the word long. L, O, ng. Three sounds. The first sound is 
Ooh. So we go down the long leg. What's the second sound? Ooh. Oh, that's right. All around the orange. Ooh. Ah. Oh. Mmg. That's the sound that we're learning today, isn't it, everybody? Who can write that digraph? I'm going to write it. Down Nobby over his net. N is the first letter. The second letter is G. That's right. Around the girl's face. Up, down, give the girl a curl. Ooh, ah, mmg. Shall we push the sound buttons and blend our sounds together? Ooh, ah, mmg. Long, long. Well done, everybody. Shall we try another one now? We've written the word long. Let's try and write this word. Can you see the person? They're hanging onto the bar. Oh, don't drop. Let's say the word hang. Hang. Let's whisper the word. Hang. Let's shout the word. Hang. Let's act the word. Let's pretend we're hanging on. Ooh. All right, everyone. Shall we sound out the word hang on our fingers? Ah, ng. Have a go by yourself. Well done. There are three sounds in the word hang. Let's have a go at writing the word hang. Down to the horse's hoof, up and over the horse's back. What's the second sound? That's right, well done. Ah, around the apple, up, down the leaf. Ah, mmg. Brilliant, well done everyone. Down, Nobby, up and over his net. That's the first letter in our new ng digraph. The second letter that we need to write is g. Brilliant. Around the girl's face, up, down, and give the girl a curl. Don't forget to write your sound buttons underneath. <sighs> ah, mmg. Shall we push our sound buttons now and read what we've written? <sighs> ah, mmg. <sighs> ang. Hang. Well done, everybody. We have written the word hang. Great job. Let's try another word now. Ooh, I would like to choose this. Have a look at this picture. Oh, it's a little bit scary, isn't it? My next word is the word fang. We have a fang tooth. Can you see it's a little bit pointy? Animals also have fangs. Let's say the word fang. Fang. Let's whisper the word. Fang. Let's shout the word. Fang. Can you point to a fang tooth? Well done. Let's sound out the word fang. Ah, ng, fang. Let's have a go at writing the word fang. The first sound is f. So we go down the flower and draw the leaves. F. Ah, around the apple, up and down the leaf. Can you write the last sound by yourself? Have you remembered it, everyone? Ah, mmg. So remember.
remember when we're writing ng, we need n and then g. Has everybody got that? A ng, ang, fang. Fantastic! Great job, everyone. To finish off today, we're going to play the game Silly Sentence. Do you remember playing this at school? It's where we have to read a sentence and then we have to draw a picture to match. And some of my sentences are a little bit silly. Shall we read this one together, everybody? I can see that our sentence begins with a capital letter. It's also a tricky word. I've got my pen here. I'm going to put some stars around it. Can you remember what this tricky word is? That's right, it's the word I. I, k, a, n, k, an, can. Good reading. I, can, E. I can spot something very special. It's today's digraph. Which digraph are we learning today, everyone? Mm, show me those muscles. If you're strong and you know it, say mmm. Well done. Let's say those three sounds again. S, e, ng, s, ing. Sing. I can sing a s -a. What can we see here? It's today's digraph. Ng. S -a -ng. S -a -ng. Song. I can sing. A song, a and, a and, and, b, a. What's the diagraph, everyone? That's right. Ng, b, a, ng, b, ang, bang, a. Oh, ng again. Oh, we've seen it a lot of times today in our sentence, haven't we? Let's push the sound buttons on our last word. G, o, ng, gong. Let's use our smooth reading to read the whole of our sentence. I can sing a song and bang a gong. Now what I would like you to do is draw a picture to match the sentence. I've drawn my picture. This is a picture of a gong. It's a musical instrument that you can play. I am singing a song and I'm playing a gong. Maybe you could email the pictures that you have drawn to me and Mrs King. Thank you for listening everyone. Bye bye.